I do the hair, trim the beard a little bit, brush the teeth. So Nate and Adam are here, and we're about to go ride Paramount Skate Park before I have to head to the OSS shop and give you a little tour of what I do on the daily. Let's check out what they're doing. Yeah, it's mine, bitches. Is it? I thought you were talking about the camera bag. Night Rider. Nate and Adam are following me in the Honda, aka the Blue Lambo, for some of you guys remember the TC episode. So we're going to a little local skate park called The Village, which is in the city of Paramount. Yo man, I don't think that's very legal. Does that thing have a Hemi? We have arrived, and it's pretty empty. Oh man, by the time we reach the OSS shop, or maybe on the way back, we'll have reached 10,000 miles. Suck it, Porsche loner. This is basically LZ's local California park. We come here pretty often when he's around. You remember I fractured my foot here last time? Oh, on the rail yeah. took over? Yeah. Damn, that is crazy. That's Bikes are still intact. Last trip, I completely forgot. Day two with the unbearable heat. And we're at the skate park with these two clowns. I think I'm melting, to be honest. This is behind the scenes of behind the scenes. You're doing a big what? Oh, oh, we can't see this. Nate, you do look like a Furby. What's up, guys? Some sort of OG in the game. LZ, not getting his clip yet. Nate, documenting the action, fraternizing with the crew. I probably said it a million times, but it's literally, what? 200 degrees, LZ? Nate, how hot is it? Las Vegas it is hotter than the devil's dick. So I think I'm gonna wrap it here and head to OSS. But first, I gotta get a Powerade or some sort of delicious icy treat. Had to take a break, catch a little breather. As you can see, I'm still in the loner. She's doing work, she's turbo, she's efficient. And the trunk popped like that. Uh, and actually, this block has a nice array of vehicles. The Mercedes GL450. We got the Cayenne Turbo. The blue Lamborghini. We got a little Tesla there. And we got a big old bro dozer. Anything else? Nah, just a bro dozer. Oh. Sparkless water truck. Nothing nicer on a hot day. Oh, snaps. So which one are you? Angel? Or the demon? A runny cowboy? The female stripper. Where do you think you're going? For those who don't know, this is the back of the OSS store, and this is where we get some editing done, podcasting, a la no jumper. Whole lot of activities, a lot of modular activities back here. Am I podcasting? Am I editing? The world may never know. Hey, Tony, who let you on the desk? That guy. You're the culprit of this. Why do you always allow this to happen? Hello, Tony. Yeah, but he doesn't love our stuff. <laughs> we'll just lean on it, maybe. All right, so I wrapped up a little bit of work today. Fucker, you're ruining it. I didn't wrap up as much work as I would have liked to today, but there was a lot of customers that came in, a lot of emails that I handled, but 
the next few episodes, I'll be able to show you a little bit more behind the scenes of what goes on in the store. Since I really didn't get to show you a lot of the behind the scenes of the OSS shop, what I can do is show you a little bit of downtown LA and Skid Row. For you guys that don't know what Skid Row is, So downtown LA has about 26,000 impoverished or people without homes and it's really sad. A lot of the buildings that you see in the background are actually missions or different kind of asylums that can help the people that are between homes out in this area. As great of a city as Los Angeles really is, it really does pain me to think about the fact that every night that I go home there's thousands and thousands of people that go home hungry or don't even have a home to go to. I wish we had a solution for it, but it's actually a little more complicated than it really seems. There are a lot of great charity organizations that do a lot in downtown Los Angeles to help that community. And, you know, we take any opportunity we can to help with whatever little we have that we're able to provide, like extra shirts or giving someone a bottle of water sometimes. So I'm wrapping it up because oh, Mr. Takes. Goddamn ruin everything, LZ. <laughs> He's getting the boot from my house. Did you have a good stay in California, mister? Yeah, I did. Sorry. Well, oh, I just ran my leg over. <laughs> I need that. How else am I going to vlog? Yeah. Anyways, uh, wish him a good departure. I think he had a good stay. Yeah, it was sick. Nate is documenting back here. I don't know, probably for some sort of Snapchat purposes. He played hooky at work today, and that's why I had a cover at the OSS store today and do a bunch of his remedial tasks. Look how but red you are. I'm very red. I got sunburned oh today. How did you get sunburned in the shop? I was at the skate park this morning. <laughs> oh. Jerks. So are we. <laughs> But I'm so much lighter. I don't know what it is. Anyways, <laughs> thanks for checking this yeah, vlog yeah, out. You light. <laughs> don't follow LZ. Follow Nate. Subscribe to me. Later. <laughs> You're so red. <laughs>